Hey guys, um, so today I thought I would do, um, a cross-stitch video. Basically, I've been seeing, sorry, I just kept keeping my finger and chewing on it. Um, I thought I would do a cross-stitch video because I've seen a lot of them. And because I don't just knit and crochet, I also cross-stitch, but I wanted to do it in a separate, and have them in a set, two separate videos, if that makes sense. So, I thought I would do, like... The one of these I think have been like a monthly update, so that's what I'm gonna do. So yeah, so I'm sure I only have three or two. Sorry, two, two finish, two finish projects. Cause I haven't been been cross stitching very long. So the first project I did was this. And it is by Dimensions, I think. Let's see, I've got another one of it. Yeah, it's Dimensions. It's this one. It's the Craft. I have a second one that I haven't, that I may do or I may give to my friend to do. I want to see if I can get her in a cross stitch, but we'll see. So, yeah, so I didn't do the letters because I wasn't, it was kind of intimidating. So, I might go back and do them, but we'll see. So, there's that one. Which I don't know what I want to do with. This, this is the second one that I did, and this is a Christmas present for the pastor at my church. So, and I'm trying to figure out, because I did the French knots in the wrong spot, so I'm trying to figure out how to fix it so they're over here, where they're supposed to be, but... So I did that one. And then, I thought I would be brave and try to design something. Um, basically, what I did was, um, I did, like, there's ten squares, and each square is a different size, obviously, um, that has a symbol or something from the different fandoms that I identify with and I'm a part of, whatever you want to call it. And what I, wa I, what I wanted was so that way, unless you at least have a working knowledge of the fandom, whether it's you, you know, you're in the fandom or you at least know about it, you know, you wouldn't fully know what the what the symbol means to, to the fandom. So this is what I have so far, and this is um, I only have one work in progress, one whip, um, simply because I this is my third project, so I don't have. Much. I'd look, there's a couple that I'd like to get, and I've got three more here, which I'll show you after, but yeah. So, this is what I have so far. Um, I don't work on it very much, so... Anyway, so this is Doctor Who. Um, this one is Lord of the Rings. It's supposed to be an elven leaf, like what they have um, the Fellowship Wars on their cloaks. Um, this is, it looks backwards to me, it might be forward once it goes up, but it says Triss, which is from, um, Divergent. I have to do, finish the R, and it's gonna be blue. Um, 12 for, um, Hunger Games, and NX-01 for, um, Star Trek, because my favorite series of the whole franchise is, um, Star Trek Enterprise, which is a prequel to Kirk. If you don't know. So, yes. And that's why, because it's an end class, it's pre-federation. So. <laughs> A little off topic. But, yeah. So, that's what I have so far. Um, for the first page that I did, I still have to do um, Sherlock, which is the, um, the new Sherlock with Benedict Cumberbatch and Martin Freeman. Well, that's not new, but it's newer. And then this one is going to be Supernatural, and I put Idjit. Because <laughs> I thought that would be kind of funny. Cut, so yeah, and I haven't figured out what colors I'm gonna do for this one yet. So it's a it's a it's a it's a trial thing. So then I have three projects. I'd like to start another one, but I'm just not sure what yet. Actually, I have more than that, but they're not in here. Um, so this is the first one. It's a Winnie the Pooh bookmark. I got it at a church sale. Actually, a couple years ago, I think. When I was just kind of thinking about cross stitch, and I saw it, and I'm like, I'm gonna get it. So I may start that at some point. We'll see. I would like to do it at some point, either way. So then I showed you this already. It's another one of those sweet ones, and I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with it. And then I have this one. It's another. 
It's a learner craft one, but it's really cute. And that's what, and it's a little cat with a ball of yarn. And, yeah, so. No, it's falling. Oh my. <laughs> my floss is falling at the bottom. So I have that. And so I'm going to really quickly show you because I just want to. I don't, I literally. Um, let's look at myself. This is what my cross stitch stuff is. This is all the, with the exception of a roll of Ada that I got. This is all my cross stitch. That's it. This is all I have. Um, so this is my floss. This is what I keep my floss in. I got this at not the same um, time, but the same sale as I got um, the Winnie the Pooh bookmark. This is a biannual sale. But anyways. So there's a lot of floss in here. Most of this was actually in here, and I've just since kind of added a bit to it for um, for this project. I am also with this one. I'm not using a hoop because I don't have one that I think is big enough, and I'm kind of too scared to put the hoop over my stitches. If that makes any sense. So I'm just freehanding it. Like I just that's why it's kind of grubby at the edges because I, I just hold it in my hand. So it's definitely going to be washed, but so yeah. So that's. So, anyways, so yeah, so it's just got the little, um, plast, or plast, um, cardboard bobbins. So yeah, so that's, that's pretty much it. Um, as far as starts, I would like to find, see if I can find a, um, a baby sampler and do one for a friend of mine who had, sorry, had a daughter in June. I'd like to see if I can find a sampler. I found one that I would I like, but I have to decide if I'm gonna buy it or not. But anyway, that I would like to do for her. I have another kind of sorry, cat just went down. Um, I have another thing that I kind of did some designing on that I want to do. I like doing like words and stuff. If that makes any sense. But anyways, that is it. Um Yeah. That's all I have. Like I said, I don't do it very much. I know a lot of people do will do like rotations. So I'll have one cross stitch project that they do one week and then another for the next week. So I'll have four projects total and do one more project for each week. But I mean, I only have one project, so I I don't have to do that. It's just kind of whenever I want to, which I might later tonight work on finish and finish the Triss square. But we'll see. So, yeah, thank you for watching my video, and hope you'll have a great day, hope, have a great day and a great month, and hopefully I'll do another one for November. I'll have some work. Bye, guys.